Oh Jesus, that scared the shit out of me. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, that did scare the ever-loving shit out of me. Oh yeah, like a Christmas ornament? Yeah. She's like, it's a secret. Yeah, she knows to hide shit from you. <laughs> Got a notification. Okay, never mind. Oops. Ah, right, come on. How did I fuck that up? Also, we went up another two subscribers, which is great. Red's crazy art gallery. Okay. Meow. Hi, baby. I love you. I love my little kitty, baby. She's adorable. Uh, playlist, Animal Crossing playlist, done. Not made for children. Save changes. Alright. Changes saved. Go to channel and then live stream. Alright. Really quick, let me check out my inventory. My purple lava lamp, that's right. <coughs> Shit. I also made sure to poo before the live stream, so we're good. I'm already assuming that's a purple lava lamp. Yeah. Cool, so I have two purple lava lamps. Nice, all right. Yo, someone else says hi, what up, man? Oh yeah, that's right, I was gonna make a poll. Uh, hold on. Create a poll, ask a question. Huh? Do you think the painting will be real? All right, create a poll, got it, okay, all right. All right, get, get some money. We've actually uh, did, a, did a lot of money yesterday, which was nice. All right. Okay, so there's another weed. I'm calling the police. And you remember she put 911 on the microwave? Um. No, this is just a crayon. Fuck them Christians, man. Wow, we have one vote so far in the poll and it was the joke answer that I always put. <laughs> I always put that joke answer. It's just like, do you think the painting's gonna be real? Yes, no, don't care. 
I always put that and it's, it's surprisingly somebody already voted for that. Da -da -da -da. All right, hey, Poncho's home. Poncho locked himself out of his house last night. That sucked. Oh, uh, huh? Yeah, I had to, um, I had fish for his key out of the river. Okay. Nine times out of ten, it's just like, oh, I lost my key in the river. Oh, there's two votes. And they're both for I don't care. That's nice. <laughs> Maybe vampire. Catch a bagworm, okay. Poncho, you're breaking my balls, man. All I want to do is give Poncho this poncho. That's all I want to do, because it'd be really fucking funny. Oh shit, alright. Not making this mistake again. I don't care at this point. Get my ass stung by bees. Again. Ass stung. Uh, ass stung Martin. Man, you know that new brand of clothes that came out that like for a while only like middle-aged forklift drivers that weighed 400 pounds would wear and now it's just like you got fucking 16 year old white girl hipsters wearing it. I'm just like, come on. That fucking brand of clothes that's like relatively new that like it was made purposely for like warehouse workers, like forklift drivers and shit. I have no idea what you're talking about. Just I I don't like I'm pretty sure if you type that into Google that it, it'll pop up. Okay, what am I typing? A new a relatively new brand of clothes that only uh warehouse workers usually wear. I I don't know the name of the brand. I just see it everywhere at work, and now I see sixteen-year-old white bitches like on the street wearing it. I'm like, come on. And it's just like, do you work at a warehouse or do you work at fucking McDonald's? You know, it's like the bitch at McDonald's fucking wears this shit. I'm just like, come on. Like, okay, listen, if it's comfy, fine, but like, what the fuck? It, usually it was like a beanie, and then now they have shirts and stuff. All right, never, okay, never mind. I don't know the name, the the brand. I don't. I literally just like I see it all the time, and it's just like. What are, what are kids trying to bring back? Oh, Jesus. I legit have one pair of skinny jeans and I my fat ass barely fits into them. Unless you're like, you know, Marshall and Lily, then... So we were watching How I Met Your Mother last night, and we got to like, the King Kong episode, where it was just really funny, where, um... Marshall and Lily had, uh, like a role-playing thing, where they had King Kong in a blonde, uh, woman wig. And it was just really funny, and you would think Lily would be the one wearing the wig, and Marshall be King Kong. Quite the opposite. It was the other way around, and I'm just like, ooh, kinky. Like, I mean, hey, listen, I'm not trying to shame nobody, but that's really fucking funny.
Like, wouldn't you think that's funny? Thank you. Was that one hurt a little? Ah, dang it. Now I'm trying to find a bagworm. Oh, here it is, got it. Because Poncho wants a bagworm, apparently. And there's absolutely no problem with that. Bagworm, bagworm, what you gonna do with the bagworm, you? Bagworm. I don't necessarily mind bagworms, but like, they're all right. You know, they're not scary or anything. Yeah. You know, I had the weirdest Rick and Morty dream last night. And it's just like, in this dream, I was super desensitized to this shit. And it's just like, here's what happened. I'm walking down the road and I see this big, Fat ass caterpillar. I'm just like, oh, that would be a good snack for uh, Ragnarok, my my lizard. And so I scoop up the caterpillar, I put it in the little enclosure, and uh, he doesn't eat it. And so like the caterpillar just stays in the enclosure for God knows how long, gets himself up on the wall and cocoons himself. I'm like, okay, so maybe Ragnarok will eat the butterfly. And. When the butterfly comes out of the cocoon, it's a fire-breathing monster that just, like, sounds like Godzilla. And I'm just sitting on the couch watching this, and I'm just like, eh. <laughs> it's just like, I was super desensitized to it. I'm like, what? Oh, man, it was fucking weird. And I'm just like, that's like the most Rick and Morty thing ever. I'm just like, what the fuck? Yeah. I was like, oh yeah, there's a fire-breathing, Godzilla-sounding butterfly rampaging in my <coughs> lizard's enclosure. <coughs> this is fine. Ah, oh, damn it. Poncho won't let me give him this poncho. I'll be like, hey, I got a gift for you. God, this guy's a dick. All right, well. All right, well. Okay, so today's the last day before um, the fucking uh, recycling bin gets taken out. All right, there's something in here, sweet. Okay, what is it? Also, I'm curious to see how much uh, that stuff is on sale for, because it seems to go up 10% every couple of days. 
Because I just can't seem to sell uh, the fucking stuff at Gracie Grace. Which, there's absolutely nothing wrong with that. Oh, do you want some foods? Does does Kitty need food? Does Baby need food? Come here, Baby. Let's go get you some food. I gotta go feed Kitty. Uh, my little baby deserves some breakfast. Well, you're not even gonna eat. You're meowing at me. Yeah, I know. She just wants to bug me. I love you, baby, though. All right, just because I'm curious, what are the turnip prices? Okay, all right. Yeah. Hey, somebody voted that they think the painting is going to be real. That's nice. Holy shit, they got that fucking sword. Yellow paint? Ew. Alright, well... Alright, I'm going to come back for the rest of this shit in a minute. I still have at least one space, right? Awesome, okay. So I have at least one space in my inventory for the painting. I'm purposely filling myself up before I come back. Actually, you know what, here's what I could do, hold on. Cause I don't want that damn invitation that he gives me. I'm hoping that the painting will be real. <laughs> the last painting that we got was uh, two weeks ago. Message retracted. Oh, I didn't see that someone else gave us a message. All right. <coughs> also, just because I'm curious, I'm going to go to Gracie Grace real quick and see what the sale prices are. That's assuming, you know, they still have shit. Oh, Jesus. All right, um. Yeah, pretty much, yeah. All right. Well, okay, let's see what the sale price is. There's only like, th there's only like three pieces left of this furniture set. How much is it? Because 50%, all right. Apparently that's the highest the discount goes. It, it's half off. So if this is 50%, it's 45,000. That means this this chair is 90 grand. All right, I'm going to have I'm going to have to come back for this. Cuz like I do again, in order to 100% this game, I have to, you know, get all the shit. 
So, oh man, that's gonna be expensive. And I did say I was gonna do it after I maxed out the, the money. Cause at that point I could definitely afford it without having to do the sale price. Oh, hey, holy shit, it's Freya. Hey. I did say I was gonna, um, you know, 100% that, so. Okay, the gold stereo I already have, and this is the flowery painting, which I know I already have. Shit. The flowery painting we got back in November, that's... Yeah, okay. Yeah, we already have that. Okay, so it's, it, it's, it's fake. Well, I mean, I don't know if it's fake, but I already have it, so what would be the point of me getting it? <coughs> Someday I plan on trying to catch all the bugs and fish in this game. I got pretty far in my old Wii, but it broke. Yeah, so did mine, and I was barely able to transfer uh, the stuff off of it. My SD card slot doesn't even work anymore, so that's, that was a real pain in my ass trying to transfer this shit. Okay, so the gold stereo, I already had that. Um, flowery painting, yeah, no, this, uh, yeah, the painting's fake. Alright, so here's what I'm gonna do. Uh, withdraw some of my money. Uh. Four, five, zero, zero, zero. I'm at least gonna get that chair, you know, for, you know. I was like, I know that the bed is gonna be way more expensive. Oh man, oh, I gotta poo again. Shit, babe, you're right. Alright, so how much is the bed and how much is the chair? Holy shit! Okay, regular retail price, it's 300k. For 50% off, it's 150, Jesus. Okay, so I can either get the chair or I can get the chest. I'm gonna get... I could get both, but I don't want to spend 45 grand on it. I'm gonna get the chest, just cuz. Alright. Cool, so that's the first piece of gorgeous furniture that I got. Alright, well. Alright, would you like to go back? Take me home. Alright, I really, really, really got poo.
And hey, what did I tell you? I was gonna be on the bus and I had to take a shit. Yeah, no, I, yeah, I really had to take a shit. Oh. Blue Bear looks like he could be a poncho. Say <laughs> that. Yeah, thanks. I didn't even- wait, hold on a second. Shit, alright, well, I wanna- Now I wanna see this. Oh, yeah, you know what? Totally, I can see it. Okay, I had to rewind the stream just to see- I had to rewind the stream just to see that bear. Alright. Oh, man. That whole broken Wii thing, that's why, um, that's why we're playing this on the Wii U. And unfortunately, I don't think we're able to mod this Wii U in order to play online, so I'm just, you know, it's whatever. Uh. <coughs> Alright, well, I got the chest, but I didn't get the chair. I'm thinking about going back for the chair. Oh, somebody's texting me. That scared the shit out of me. It's my friend Tyler. <laughs> All right. Old dirt wall. Let me take a wild guess and say that okay, blueberry looks like Yeah, okay, I already read that. Catalog, please. I just wanna see something if um the gorgeous bed I can't uh I can't buy the gorgeous stuff. I didn't nearly get all the mushroom stuff that I wanted to get. Yeah, I, that's what I thought. Okay, you cannot buy the gorgeous stuff. Or you can't rebuy it. That sucks. So if you get the gorgeous stuff, don't sell it. Alright, what are the turnip prices? Okay then, alright. I'm glad I sold them when I did. Sold them yesterday for a profit, and I'm happy about that. And I'm starting to think that's the highest it's going to get all week. Are there any villagers that are not in City Folk that are not in City Folk that I like? Um, I don't know which ones that are I mean, you're talk probably talking about a new one that, you know, came after this game like New Leaf. Um I just found out recently that Tangi is in this game and I love Tangi. She's she's awesome. Uh that are uh, villagers that are not in this game. I don't know. It's a very good question. Maybe like the older Animal Crossing games, like they were like they were exclusive. All right, hey Vesta, what's up? In my butt. A personal greeting. All right. What should Vesta's greeting be? I have a keyboard, so it'll be it'll be better. <coughs> that are not in City Folk. That's actually a very good question. Are there any like GameCube exclusive villagers? Like they're like they're only on the GameCube and they never came back. Um, I did like that monkey, the the train driver monkey. Cause like it wasn't um it wasn't Cap'n who was the, the train driver, it was a monkey, and the monkey was actually really cool, and I, I liked him, but he's not a villager. I'm just gonna extend that to NPCs. Like, I would have to say the monkey from uh, the original Animal Crossing. That's a very good question. I ha Yeah, that's, that's a very good question. Does anybody have anything for, uh, for Vesta's special greeting?
Alright. Oh, wait. I can't think of anything, but that would be <laughs> weird. Yeah. Spicy nugs. I like spicy chicken nuggets. I'm so happy that Wendy's finally brought them back, and now it's just like once a week I'll go to Wendy's and get like a 10 piece spicy nug. You can't, you can't not go to Wendy's and not get the spicy nugs. Like, live for the spicy nugs. Like, Burger King, like, I fucking hate Burger King, but, like, they're really stepping up their nug game, where, like, they had, like, the Carolina Reaper chicken nugs, and holy shit are those fucking good. And, like, they're not even that spicy, but, like, they're really good, like, the delicious to spice ratio is way off, but it, they're, again, they're good. Curse words, <laughs> yeah. But I had to misspell it because it wouldn't let me. Yeah, no, I learned that on the first day we played this. Uh, literally a year and 25 days ago. We started this Let's Play on New Year's. And that's why that's why every episode is dated. Where it's like it has the, you know, the date and the title of the video. But yeah, no, that was really fucking, yeah. I think the first one that I tried to do was just like eat shit or something like that. And the game's just like, you can't do that. I'm like, oh. But yeah, no, they yeah they would they wouldn't let me. I learned that like day one. I'm like, damn it. Originally, when we started this let's play, it was just for funsies. Now I'm trying to 100% the game. There is a few items that I know for a fact that I won't be able to get for the uh, catalog, and that's fine because they're online items. Uh, like the stuff that uh, uh, Katie and Kate give you. Um, those are online only exclusive and there was like a piece of DLC item uh, That you can only get from online. It was one of the jingle stuff. It was the uh, the jingle TV Which that sucks because like if you want to complete the jingle stuff like all the Christmas stuff You had to have that one piece of DLC, which is bullshit, but you know Yeah, you had yeah, you had to have um, online for that Which I thought was stupid, but whatever <coughs> Originally, my criteria for 100% was uh, the museum, and uh, we have all but three fish and all but two bugs. We have all of the dinosaurs, and we're missing just a few paintings. So that's cool, you know? But every painting that we get, it just makes it harder for the next one. But yeah, completing the catalog is gonna suck. Cause then we have to buy all the Gracie Grace stuff and it's just, it's just a nightmare. We already got our tree items for the day. It's like, hey, Poncho, can I can I give you that Poncho yet? All right, Poncho's still home. I gave him that bagworm that he wanted, but I wait, did he even give me? Oh yeah, he gave me that wall. That wallpaper. You just talk about playing Call of Duty. My, I think he said my voice cracked while I was playing online. I'm just like, are you talking about Call of Duty? This is Modern Warfare. Well, I mean, yeah, Modern Warfare 2. Well. I don't remember when Modern Warfare 2 came out, but... Damn it. It's like, Poncho, I want you to wear this poncho.
Oh, you know what? Hold on a second. Is the could the fossil possibly be over here? They barely ever check over here. It's not. I barely ever check over there, and there's a reason for that. I mean, shit, there could be an absolute fuck ton of weeds over there, and I would never know. <coughs> well, painting was fake. And that sucks. Oh yeah, that's right. I was gonna go buy. Uh, I was gonna go buy all the stuff at uh, Nooks. That's right. I forgot. That's right. I forgot. I was go gonna go buy all the stuff at Nooks. Man, why is all this shit cheap? A train set, I don't think I have that. Hello, yo, it's Kirby Things. What up, Kirby Things? Yo. Hello, hello, hello. All right. <laughs> I don't feel comfortable doing that accent as an American. All right. Really quick, let's go get all these carpets. Hey, honey. You gotta say it in a southern accent. Oh, I, I don't know how to do southern accent. Hey, before I go to work, did you want to get Wendy's? Because now I'm really craving Wendy's spicy nugs. Awesome. Again, I really don't know how to do a southern accent. Because, like, I'm from, like, the west coast and the midwest at the same time. And it's just, like, my, my American accent is just, like, a, a weird amalgamation of, like, west coast and Chicago. And it's really weird. And everybody's just like, where are you from? Like, te technically Chicago. Yeah, the, mid the midwest coast. <laughs> I love that. Thank you. I never had a name for that, thanks. The Midwest Coast. What, it's still funny. The fact that there's a word for it now. I mean, you got like a really like white girl accent, so. 
I mean, kind of, sort of. It was a little weird, because, like, um, when Gloria was first setting us up, it, people don't know, uh, our friend Gloria uh, set me and my girlfriend up. We've been happily dating for four years now. Um, we, uh, when, when Gloria set us up, uh, she told me, you know, Haley's Chinese, and I'm just like, oh, dude, that's awesome. And, like, at, at, at that point, I had no idea that she was adopted, and I'm just like, okay, so I didn't know what to expect. And then when I heard you start talking, I'm just like, oh, you have a, you have a white girl accent. All right. <laughs> and I was just like, okay. Well, yeah, okay, all right, okay, I'll give you that. Well, yeah, no, and we've been happily dating ever since. You wanna know why? Cause I love my girlfriend. Holy shit, Buck's house. Wait, we got a new person? Is this a horse? Who the fuck is this? Wait, they have horses? Hold on. Oh, dude, it is a horse. All right, yo, hey, buddy. Well, you must be my new Dr. Pepper neighbor. What up? My name is Buck. And I like to fuck. <laughs> no. Oh, you know what? If I ever get a greeting, I absolutely am going to have that as, as his greeting. <laughs> That's a Kill Bill reference for anybody who's listening. <laughs> My name's Buck, and I like to fuck. <laughs> oh, man. <coughs> Oh, there's, you know, my one Kill Bill joke for the day. Holy shit, that was fucking funny. I forgot that they had horses. Ugh. Where could that one fossil be that I'm missing? I mean, you get three per day and I only found, you know... I also totally forgot to do, um, I also totally forgot to do, uh, the Wisp event last night. Wisp came to town and I forgot to do that. Hey, Octavian, what up, man? Damn it! Fuck, I just sold pill bugs. He's like, hey, can I get a pill bug? Fuck, I just sold a bunch of those. I don't even know if I can get any more. Well, at least he's not asking for a centipede, which is nice. Hey, Blue Jay used to live here. Our housing placement is so weird. The houses are like, they're scattered all over the place, which is fine. Oh, this is going to be very interesting because I sold a bunch of pill bugs and I don't think I'm going to be able to do this side quest. Oh, got it. Yes. Okay, cool. All right. All right. I didn't know you can get more. All right. Hidden weed. Is that a weed? Yeah, no, I can't. I can't seem to find that last fossil for the day. I mean, there's supposed to be three, and I only got two. Oh god, oh, motherfucker! Oh, never mind. Shit. 
bug. Again, that's really frustrating. Go give this pill bug. I mean, hey, that's two side quests that we got done today, so that's nice. You risked your life and limb for my pill bug. All right. A country guitar. I don't want that. No bug is too rare. Dude, it's not a rare bug, man. Now, if somebody came up to me and like, hey, do you want to buy a tuna off of me? I'm like, all right, I'll go buy a tuna. Because we still need the damn tuna. We didn't get that last year. Hell, that's why I'm in my fishing outfit. Like, I'm I'm wearing like a fishing vest. That's too that's too small, but I'll catch it anyway. So hey, honey, what do you want from uh, Wendy's? Actually, wait, you know what? Here, hold on a second. On the off chance they still have it, the, the Carolina Reaper chicken nuggets. You wanna go to Burger King? It's closer. All right. Cause I could also use that coupon for the uh, uh, buy two of the chicken sandwiches. So I can get two chicken sandwiches and a 10 piece spicy nug. That sounds like a good deal to me. I want my spicy nugs. Vom red. Wow. I don't understand what the fuck those messages are. They're bots. Thanks, man. Appreciate it. I mean, at least it's, you know, traffic. Like, I don't mind getting comments, but at the same time, it's just like, it's traffic. If that were a comment on a, you know, a posted video rather than a live stream, then again, it's, it's traffic. Like, oh, hey, there's, you know, comments on this video. Sweet. Cool. Bless you, honey. Bless you. One more time, it's five bucks. There's one last thing I can do before I want to end the stream. I'm 
gonna go check the lost and found. <coughs> is it just me or was the lost and found in the original Animal Crossing on the GameCube? Uh, was that the best lost and found ever? People who played the original Animal Crossing know what the hell I'm talking about. Be like, oh yeah, I remember the lost and found. That was great. They had some good shit. Like, you go there at least once a day, every day, you get some really good shit. You can deck your entire house out with, you know, cool, cool uh, furniture. Expensive furniture that you essentially get free. All right, so that was empty. Yeah, no, I'm, I really, really, really want to play the OG Animal Crossing on GameCube. And um, I, I want to get one of those HDMI conversion jobs on my GameCube. Uh, so that way um, we can, you know, record straight HDMI, which would be great. Um, unfortunately, my capture card does not have a setting like that, so... But, I mean, hey. Hmm. Oh, okay, so she's just gonna steal the fucking... Alright. Oh, no, she gave it back. Alright, cool. Never mind. Ugh. Drop. Uh, all right. Well, my name has been Jason Fisher, and we will see you guys in the next episode. Unfortunately, the painting was not real. And uh, we'll see you guys next time. Peace out real quick. Hold on. I need to fuck with the text document real quick. Seven. Got it. Okay. All right. And peace out.